Hi folks, welcome to another Monday Marks Market Update. Today I'm going to talk about energy efficiency standards for leasing out properties. A new legislation that's been brought in that you do really need to be, uh, be aware of. Just wrapping up the week that's been with auction, so 170, uh, 107 sorry, properties went to auction over the course of the week with a clearance rate at 52%. So let's have a look at this uh, minimum standards for energy efficiency rating. This is going to be valid for all properties that are listed from the 1st of April this year. So really it's coming uh, around very very fast and it means that all properties listed for lease have to then note the energy efficiency rating. This is going to be a more stand, a more important or pertinent for properties that were built prior to 1997 where they didn't really have a lot of insulation as standard on all those properties. There will be a partial exemption for people that are going to have to spend more than $10,000 um, upgrading the energy efficiency of the property um, and the key again is that they just need to advertise the energy efficiency. There might even be some no interest loans that the government are going to use to help people. Let's just understand and unpack this a little bit more. This is going to be relevant primarily for homes, like I said, built before 1997, but properties where the ceiling insulation is R2 or less, they now need to be upgraded to meet an R5 ceiling insulation. However, there is a loophole. If the property already has over R2 ceiling insulation, you don't need to do anything to it. It's deemed to still be compliant. So it's really only for R2 or less that you're going to need to upgrade, the, especially that ceiling insulation to R5. So I think that's very important to be aware of. You can't now just pop your property on the market and uh, just let the tenant just deal with it. Your property manager is going to check you've done an energy efficiency rating and if it comes out at too low an R rating, you're gonna have to spend some money on that property. So make sure you chat to your property manager or chat to us. Make sure your properties are compliant going forward and have a great week. I hope the video's helped out.